AGP here. How you doing? How you doing? Good morning. Something been on my mind. I got a couple that got married about two or three weeks ago in Charleston, West Virginia. And they're a happy young couple, you know. You know how young lovers are. They just, you know, moving along, you know. Well, they came to see me. They came here on their honeymoon. And they come see Grandpa. Ah, I love it. Come see your Grandpa. Your Grandpa loves you. Ah. <laughs> anyway. They're telling me about their wedding, right? And how nice it was. And the little boat ride. And. That little flower girl, you know, doing a little thing, you know. Then they told me about the reception. At the Ramada Inn in Charleston, West Virginia. Now I got a method to my madness, you know I always do. Anyway, it cost him over $3,000 for that reception. I don't know about you, but it'd take me a long time, if ever, to, to raise that much money for a reception. But they were in love, and they got married, and God bless them. They're nice. They're a nice young couple. You know, I consider them my children, you know, because we got along so well. Damn, I don't know what the fuck that was. Anyway, there a lot of shit wasn't right with the reception. The Ramada Inn in Charleston, West Virginia, their rooms really weren't that clean. Now, they, they got a whole long list of shit that was wrong. I'm just gonna give you a few. The rooms were a little dirty, you know. The bride's phone didn't work, so she had to use her cell phone. She called down to the front office about it, but they never did nothing about the phone. The fuck, you paid that much for a room? At the Ramata Inn in Charleston, West Virginia. Virginia. Damn, I don't know what the fuck I eat. It tastes nasty. Uh, yeah, I ain't even mentioned their name, but I want to congratulate Alan Newman and his new bride, Shonda Bell Newman. Congratulations on being married. I give it about five years and you be fight like me and my ex old lady. <laughs> I hope not. And I hope you ain't got no vagina spiders, okay? Alan, if she's got vagina spiders, call Terminex right now. Anyway, at the reception, they were supposed to have cheese and fruit on the bar. I know this is minor shit, but come on. When it's your special day, you want everything perfect. That's what you pay for. That's why they got a wedding planner. He's supposed to make the wedding planner, man or woman, whichever, is supposed to make sure everything's right. That everything you paid for is there. The cheese, the fruit wasn't there. The wait staff was supposed to was supposed to cut the cake and serve it to the guest. How the fuck they gonna do that when they dancing on the floor? They won't even take time out to do the fucking job. Anyway, there was a long list of stuff that wasn't right with the reception. So Grandpa I'd tell him. I said, you know, call Ramada in in Charleston, West Virginia. And tell, you know, and just tell them, you know, Shonda, say, hey, things weren't right. You know, I realize I can't get all my money back, but hell, give me, give me a bone, give me something, throw me a bone. Case closed. You had your reception. Case closed. Fuck you. Case opened. AGP just opened a son of a bitch. Now, you, you know, I know you, you know, Ramada Inn in Charleston, West Virginia, is a bunch of cheap Charlie sons of bitches. You know, I understand that. It's all about the dollar. It's all about the dollar. Well, if you ain't gonna give them no fucking money, which you should be, you know, hell, over $3,000, you ought to give them 500 of it back. But no, we know you're not gonna do that. We know you're not gonna do that because you're assholes. You heard it. Grandpa just called you an asshole, Ramada Inn, in Charleston, West Virginia. And I done called them, people. I done called and told them I thought they were wrong and they were doing the wrong thing. And then you do something. If you don't want to give them their money back, some of their money back, because I know you, you don't, they don't deserve all their money back. 
I realize they deserve something though. Why don't you give them a, a free weekend to any Ramada in the United States that they want? The, the good room, not one of them little cheap Charlie motherfuckers that everybody else has to take. I mean a good room, the honeymoon suite, something like that. Give it to them for a weekend. Do something. It's just not fair. It's just not fair to, to, to make them, 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 them children suffer because you didn't do your fucking job. Ramada Inn, Charleston, West Virginia. I keep saying your name a lot because I want all my youngest to hear it. And I wouldn't be surprised if a lot of my youngest don't give you a call. And say, hey, make it right. Shonda Bell, look it up. You'll find her. Look and see where you took her fucking over $3,000. Now, what you need to do, Ramada, is fire that son of a bitch that you call a wedding planner. Fire that fucker. Hire somebody that's willing to tell the wait staff, you ain't supposed to be dancing with the guests. Your ass supposed to be working. Do your job. I'll give you two weeks. If I don't hear from Shonda saying that y'all made something right, I'm going to do another video. And this ain't gonna be nice. And this is going to your fucking home office. I promise you. I will make it. And I will send it straight to them. And don't think I don't have enough people that I can't get you a fucking bunch of calls if I want it. Because all I gotta do is say, Young is, you need to call these fuckers. And they'll do it. And ask some of these companies that, that I've shut down for two and three days at the time. Because they didn't want to do what was right. And treat their people like they're supposed to be treated. With integrity. With dignity. No, you just want their money. That's all you want. And screw them. So, Ramada Inn in Charleston, West Virginia. Make it right. You will hear from me again in about two weeks. And this time, it will not. I won't be smiling. <laughs> I'll be after your blood. Good luck, Alan Shonda. Let me know if anything develops on this, okay? Bye, youngins. Grandpa gone.